Hey guys, and welcome back to Soma. I feel a little bit better now that we have Catherine, even though she's in our Omni tool, at least we're not alone. I have no idea what we're going to get up to in this episode. I last left off in like an under underwater sunken ship thing. I think it's called the Curie. So let's get started and see what we get up to today. Simon has found the wreck of the Curie, a large ship on the bottom of the sea. In it, he hopes to find an emergency vessel and travel to the site called Theta. I love these little recaps. It really does help to just explain everything that we've done in a much better way than I could do it. So thank you, Soma Game. You are very helpful. Ah, uh, yes, yes, I remember. I remember. Here we are. That's, yes, yes, yes. We came from that door there. So, it should be somewhat okay for now. Uh, hopefully, we aren't about to. Oh, <gasps> emergency shuttle. That's what we want. Um, can I break that glass? No, that does not work. That would have been lovely, <laughs> but never mind. Oh God, oh God. <laughs> this game is so scary. I don't, I, I should not be playing something like this. Wow, look at that picture. My goodness, that's beautiful. This was, this must have been someone's, it's just a little, a nice little room that people go in. Look, I don't belong playing this game. I truly don't. <sighs> okay, flashlight on. Flashlight on. The lights are red. Look, the music is scary. The lights are red. Get out of here. I gotta get out of here. I don't know how to get out of here. I need to get out of here. I can't even. I can't look up. I have to get out of this room. Oh god. Nope, 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 nope. This is the room that we were. that we were first in. thing with that with that creature here I couldn't even watch the TV which said you know the stuff that was happening God. what's 
that? Nothing. Like, I want to know about what's happened to this world, but it's very difficult to explore, even honestly, on safe mode. Because, oh jeez. Nope, there's a thing in that room. Nope, nope, nope. Where are you? Where are you? Oh god. Just keep going. Just keep going. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. This is a maze of tunnels and... God, there it is. There it is. Okay, just turn away. Oh, it's down the hallway. It's just down the hallway there. It must just keep... Yes, it keeps walking around. It's okay, we'll keep going. Oh my god. I see it, I see it. This... I mean, what's that? The rib cage of... go here and I'm sorry I'm not being very brave F11 wow this is that's where I came oh gosh that's um where I came from so if I just keep following the corridors I should be okay so that guy he does a loop I need to just keep in mind that they can't hurt me, but it's very difficult to to have that mindset in this kind of environment. And honestly, I'm lost. I don't know where I am. Oh God! He's literally right there. This is pretty. Look at this for a bit. He just needs to get his butt out of the doorway. F-14, okay, F-14, it's a dead end, oh my gosh, okay, I saw a hallway down the side there where this creature is, if I just don't look at it, if I just keep looking down, F-13, there's Oh, okay, nice. Absolutely beautiful, that. <gasps> okay, just keep going. There was nothing in that room. Many things we don't need to look at. F12? I swear that I've seen these numbers before. F11? I've been here. Emergency shuttle. That's the room that we started in just there. That's the room. Let's get that turning. Can we open that? Okay, so that's going to bring down. Nope, you don't see me. I'm looking at the floor. doesn't see anything if I can't see it it can't see me that's that should be how monsters work there are so many dead here so many dead okay so if we I think we got to go up that ladder but I haven't been down this way what I, I why would I even want to 
that door is locked. It's shut. There doesn't seem to be any like much info. <laughs> What's that? Toby McFryer is cyclone. It must be a movie or something. Okay, let's just Oh. Oh. Alright. I'm ready to head up the ladder. I just wanted to have a little look around in case there were any secrets or things like that, but we are ready please to get up this ladder and that creature better not be on this floor. I am not interested. So not interested. Okay. Please be a nicer floor. Gosh. We've, we've made it. I'm terrified. So now we're on the top level. You know what? Of course there's going to be one of these things roaming around, isn't there? Of course. Of course there is. Why Why would it be nice? Okay, well, I, I'm just... I'm just really happy that we've actually made it to the This looks like, like a kitchen area or something. What's that noise? What's that noise? Did you hear? There's some moaning, there's groaning sounds, moaning and groaning noises. Come on. It's on this floor too. Come on. Please don't. <sighs> no, it's in here too. It's in here too. What am I meant to do? It's everywhere. Absolutely. I couldn't even, I don't even have the words to explain crew, how that would feel. The final efforts to stop the comet have officially failed. Impact is imminent. That's just that's the worst. I honestly do fear something like that. Look, I can't go, I can't go anywhere. This stupid thing just follows me around. I'm not your friend. Impact is imminent. I'm I'm not its friend. I don't want to be its friend. Attention crew, this is your captain's speech. Squish it would go away. The final efforts to stop the comet have officially failed. Impact is imminent. I don't see you and you don't see me okay look this is almost impossible I don't know how people can play this if it's not in safe mode <laughs> because I don't even know where I am I can barely move because of this thing that is desperate to be my friend Oh, there's another another stairs okay okay so we're on the third level that's certainly getting somewhere fourth level okay okay f31 okay there's so many rooms here but 
I... I don't know what's useful and what's not, unfortunately. We're looking for that um, escape vessel. Just those noises. I hear noises everywhere. This room looks promising. Okay, this room looks quite promising. Reactor temp 99%. Can we... Reactor temp 81%. Is this the right thing that we're meant to be doing? Reactor temp service required. Okay. Perhaps it's maybe it's not what we're meant to be doing. <laughs> oh my gosh! What just? Oh God! No! No! Stop! Stop! I don't know where they are. This is... Oh! I don't know where the emergency vessel is. That got that thing in the way. Is it... It's blocking that way. I've just got to go. Go, go, go. I think I had to do that. But I don't know where the emergency vessel is. That, 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 that's my biggest problem right now. So I don't know where the vessel is. Oh gosh. I think I've, I think I've wrecked it. So I don't know where the vessel is. Oh my God. No, it's not up that way. I don't know where this thing is. I'm just going downstairs now. With this thing on my tail. Guys, I think I've done something wrong here. I think there must have been something I didn't go to or haven't done. No. Because I unfortunately don't know where the emergency vessels are. Oh, hang on. Oh my god, I've made it. I actually found this thing. I, I've got to put this thing in there. I messed up, okay? Can you get us out of here? I did, yes, I messed yes. up. I just need to pump the water out and get a trajectory in place. Hurry up. up. Just a second. I found it so difficult to navigate this ship in the dark with the that creature. That was really difficult and I was panicking. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I feel bad. Can you steer this thing? Starboard rotor is choking, but I can compensate. How do you even know what direction we're going in? No worry, I'm hooked up to the navigator. We're headed for Theta. Should be a matter of minutes. I thought I was done for back there. Seems like the WoW was keeping the Curie from going into a catastrophic failure state. I, I mean, how did it get on the ship? Are you talking about the black tentacles in the engine room? I've seen them before at Upsilon. What are they? They're a manifestation of a malfunctioning station-wide artificial intelligence called the WoW. Station-wide? So we just made a powerful enemy. No, no, it's not like that. The AI isn't a persona. It doesn't feel or think like we do. It's more like, uh, it's more like a cancer. Okay. Was that okay. the ship? Looks like your sabotage worked better than expected. Brace for impact! Well, okay, well, I'm not even sat oh, down. Just push us off the plateau! What does that mean? If I don't hit Delta, we're dead. I, I have all the faith in the world in Catherine. I think we're going to be just fine. I trust her. 
remain seated. Is this for real? There are actually going to be people here? No, that's not true. Not true. That's just automated. That's just automated. This is not enough. Are we okay? We're okay. We're upside down, but we're okay. Is Catherine okay? <sighs> okay, so what... What absolute horrors await us here? Look, I just want to say a couple of things. I am sorry for my behavior in the Curie, but I was panicking and it was very difficult to navigate. I had no idea where I was. I don't know if I did the wrong thing at all, but I tried my best. I'm sorry. I'll never get this open. Oh, why not? Um, oh gosh, oh my god. Is that going to be one of those little, little helper robots? Yes. Oh, hey little guy. Didn't expect to see you again. Hi. I like you. Thank you. He's... He is a robot that I want to be friends with. He is a creature I want to be friends with. Not these other people. Don't worry, Kat. I'll find a way to say Hi, thank you. Oh, I love that. <laughs> wow. Well. What do we do now? What do we do now, little guy? We just, we're on the ocean floor, so deep down. <sighs> no idea where we are. We have to get to Theta. I don't know what that says, it's so blurry. But I, I much prefer being on, on the ocean floor. I find it relaxing and beautiful, which is crazy. Hey, more of these little guys. They're broken. Oh wow. I I think they're broken. They're your buddies, aren't they? They're your buddies. They're broken. Hmm. Okay, so here we are. I love the crabs. Look at them. Hi! That's so cool. <gasps> Turtle! Yeah, this is nice. I like being down here. <gasps> There's a robot! He's... He's gonna be someone, isn't he? He's... What? You talk? Oh, he's going over in that direction. Um, just a minute. I... I want to just look here for a second. Oh, I thought that was going to be like Carl, but no, it, it's not. I, I'll be there with you soon. At least he's following me along here. I love this. This is nice. Oh, look at the tracks. It's... Hang on, hang on. I think I may check that way that the little guy was pointing at, just in case, because he was pointing over here. I, I don't want to miss out on anything, so I'm going to have to go and look at everything. Now that I'm not so panicked, it's this way, I just want to make sure I, I a long drop. Find everything. Yeah, that is a long drop. That is a long drop. There's so many beautiful sounds in the ocean. So many beautiful noises. Okay, if we follow along this path there's two ways to go I I will go both ways 
but I just don't know which way to go. I just feel that following these paths it's got to lead to something somewhere. Hmm. You know what? Maybe not. Because this hasn't really led to anything. Open. Oh, that says Delta. Good robot. I'll come back there, but thank you. Yes, thank you so much. Good robot indeed. Good robot indeed. Fascinating that these mechanics and robotics can survive underwater like that and not be rusted up. So this is where where I was going, then I stopped. have found the way that we do need to go. But careful Simon, careful. Because we're near the edge, yeah. Very careful Simon. Very careful Simon. Number two. Is that what um, he opened that? Yes, he opened that. That must be where we go then. Uh, there's other places, but... Not really anything. Oh! What should I do with that? No signal. What does that exactly do? No signal. No signal. No. Oh, I can move it around. So nothing has a signal. If we go on channel one and then. Is this actually going to bring up anything? I would probably, I could be here for hours <laughs> doing this. I don't know if anything brings up anything. I don't know what to do with that. I'm going to leave that for now. Maybe we'll find some info about what to do with that. Um... Hang on. Can you open? Can you open the door? Ah, there we go. There we go. Pressurized door. Hang on, what is this? I don't want to go anywhere. Oh no, I didn't want to go anywhere. Oh. I see. Whoa. Oh my god. Well, this place is safe to look at, but terrible. My 
reflection in the black blood of our modern whispers. I need to save them from this hell, but let let them sleep. Lock them in the lucid dreams I've seen. That's written in blood. That's locked. I feel that there is something in there that we don't want to look at. My gosh. A chess game. <laughs> Corrupt opponent. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not wrong with that. It's exciting to watch WoW claim Delta. Half a year ago, I'd be worried I'd have Goya and Wen clean the black blood from the machinery. Now its crusty surfaces seem to complement, even outshine, what Delta was. What's wrong with this person? What's wrong with this fellow that, that's written this? They've gone crazy. The light is burning my eyes. He's telling me I don't need this vicious flesh inside my skull to see salvation. I will gladly remove them. Stop them from obfuscating the divine illusion. It's hard to read, dude. Sorry. This is really very worrying. Very, very worrying that this guy... Whoever ha <laughs> It's just gone absolutely crazy. Wow. Alright. Interesting room. Very interesting room. I wonder if there's other little places like that. It's the only only one that I can find. Maybe we should go have a look. I would love to find... Oh, there's another one. Come on, little guy. I must have shut. Probably for the best. Oh. I'm not sure I trust the shuttle train anymore. That's the shuttle train. Okay, okay. So he's not going to... to... to open that one. Okay. That is fine. I would love to find more little rooms like that place that we were just in. Even though they're very creepy and full of terrible things. I'm curious. There is a lot of beauty in this abandoned world under the sea. Delta. Thank you. Thank you very much. These places should be relatively safe to explore, correct? Pressurized door. I, I hope so. Oh, actually, you know what? I'm thinking it's not. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's have a look. UH manual. What is that? Oh, that's our little guy, K8. K8. That's him. Light Universal Helper. While the K8 lacks a voice module, it is able to communicate via simplified sounds and lights. The Bull. Medium Worker. Topa. Complex Intelligence. Qualia. I don't think I've seen that one. A pilot is needed to fully utilize its equipment. I wonder if that's something that we can use. Messages. 
Delta evacuation. Terry, it's been decided that you and your crew will evacuate to Theta on the 14th. Everything is being taken care of and you will all be given new positions as you arrive. You will have to fall into the ranks, of course. The last thing we need are more leaders. And then Terry's written back. He's not happy. He's not going anywhere. You don't have the authority to make me. This isn't my orders, you idiot. I'm just the messenger. You want to stay? I can buy you some time if you want to hang out at your dump, but your crew is moving tomorrow. You know what? I reckon Terry didn't go anywhere. He just, he did stay. Mr. Akers, I'm happy to inform you that your crew has safely arrived at Theta. Let me know when you are ready to move and I'll send a transport. He won't go. Merry Christmas, Mr. Akers. Don't hesitate to ask if you want to be relocated to Theta. He never left. He never left. Wow. Main local access, Terry. Terry has won his 1,000th game of chess. This guy is, um... Games won 1,000. Terry Akers. I hope that we don't find Terry here being weird and scary. about what we're going to find in this next room. Oh, it's just a bathroom. Well, then where's Terry? What happened to Terry? Where's Terry, then? There's no... skeletons or... or anything left. Where... where's Terry? <laughs> room. That was really interesting. I... I want to know what happened. That's cool. That's... <gasps> Is that Terry? Oh my god. You know what? Oh god, I think we found Terry. There's nothing I can do with him. My gosh. I think we found Terry. That's what happened to Terry. There's Mr. Akers. Merry Christmas, Terry. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh, wow. so bad you know it, normally we can um, access these guys memories and thoughts and stuff but it's just not happening here shipping it's just general oh request transport oh uh, okay of course yep yeah, it's not working of course Antenna. Transport positions lost. Manually adjust the antenna. That's that thing that we were trying to work on. Then what, um, oh! Oh my gosh, I need to write that down. Can you see the three colors? That's what we had, um, uh, yes, yes. If I write that down and then copy, what's here we might be okay i think i can i can try i've written it down i'll do my best okay so i think what we need to do is maybe oh signal string oh gosh i that's that what we see there is just what i've done over there with the antenna and that's not enough signal but how do i know what to put it what, what to do? 
Recovered two files. Strasky, I can see the Zeppelin now. Good. Sorry about the mess. Without the positioning system, the Zeps just keep losing their set routes. Volchek did say that you could have fixed it on your side by rejigging the antenna. Guess it doesn't matter now. Are, are all of you coming? No, just me, Goy, and Creer. Acres is set up being a stubborn old man. All right. <laughs> see you soon, Brandon. Happy evac. We need to fix that antenna so we can get um, something out, a zeppelin out of here. Peter, can you hear me? Uh, I hear you, Terry. Uh, I mean, Mr. Akers, sir. I've changed my mind. I would like to come to Theta. Let Delta sleep. Oh. Of course. <laughs> wow. Uh, honestly, didn't expect to hear from you again. Uh, such a long time since you checked in. <gasps> we have a few divers in a zeppelin surveying Lambda at the moment. I'll just... Make sure they pick you up when they're done. Okay. Uh, thank you for the warning. I'll, I'll make sure they feel welcome. <laughs> okay. Uh, see you when you get here. <laughs> oh, Terry went weird. No, 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 no. I think he killed those people. Did you hear his sinister laugh? He's done something not good. Mr. Akers. Oh my gosh. He's killed them. So where is Terry now? I would love to find. I know that he's not alive. It's not possible for him to be alive down here. But my gosh, that's so That's so interesting. He's a little bugger that Terry, isn't he? Here? Oh, that must have been the first one. Let me open it, maybe. Oh, God. Is that Terry? You saw that, right? You saw Akers fucking injecting that shit into them? He got me pretty bad. I think I made it worse pulling away. I, I can feel it bleeding out. Can you see him? Fuck. He got on the Zeppelin. <gasps> He's going back to Theta. Wow. We have to warn them. Good luck with that. The platform radio is dead. Remember? The Lumor Annex should work. It has to. Yeah. You go. I'm not gonna make it. I'm just not. Come on, Evans. We have to warn him. Come on. Oh my God, this is scary. This is scary. I'm scared. I can't believe what Terry did. He's crazy. He's crazy. Wow. That is so fascinating. Mr. Akers, you naughty man. So, so interesting. How are the Am I right? Can't believe how much I'm sweating in this suit. Is this guy safe? I think I need some vacation soon. Have to speak with Akers about that. Isn't that right, Akers? I don't know where Akers is, dude. Hey, could you maybe help? I need to get to Theta. Don't worry about it. I got this. Oh. Yeah? You put in a good word for me? <laughs> I'm not sure that's a good thing. Nah. I'm just messing with you. This guy's cute. Hey, you. Don't stand there. You know better than that. Brandon, did you move the Carthage casing? We need to test that one before we ship it. He's cute, but he's not helpful. Hey, can you hear me? Help me out here, will you? Hey, you. Give me some room, will you? No, he doesn't do anything. Melissa, help me out here, will you? Oh. Hey, you. Give me some room. Damn it. You? Okay, well, I think I've looked everywhere. I don't know. I hope. I think what we need to do now is somehow 
try and work out this antenna system oh the thing that we saw back over there says that it has no like the, the signal strength wasn't enough can I so I can't change the direction of the green, yellow, and red. But I wonder if I can just um, sort of work out. Where'd that thing go? There it is. If I can just somehow work out the, the signal strength of it. Transport positions lost. Manually adjust antenna. So, oh! Oh no, no, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I think I need to put the purple antenna on the yellow one, on, on the theta. I'll try. You let her manage your payload? What? That doesn't even make sense. Come on, stop messing around and get back to work. Okay, well, let's try that. If that's. If that's on that, I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. I'm so interested to know what happened with Terry Akers. Did he really make it to Theta? I don't get it. It's got to have something to do with them being on those lines, right? I'll just keep trying everything. Link established. 049. Okay, do I need to then? <gasps> Link established. Oh, okay. I get it now. I need to manually adjust and then pick the correct number when it's on the beam, I think. Yes, okay, I get it. I was just a bit slow. <laughs> Just a bit slow, but I get that now. This is a really interesting part. I am enjoying myself here. And there we go. Now Did that. You the outer shields? No, the thin one, the yielder. Yeah, yeah, I know it's not. Cool. This should be doing something now. Zeppelin transport. This should be able to now call in. Yes, there we go. Signal strength is full. I should now be able to call in. That's working. It's everywhere. What? Hello? Who's that? It's everywhere. Is anyone... All about water. We're drowning. Who is this? Alan. What's your name? Simon. Where... What are you? This is so creepy. Alan, can you hear me? Alan? Zeppelin not responding. Can I request the tr the transport? Engine failure? What do I do? Not responding. No one else? Oh my gosh. Engine failure? What do... Wow. Okay. Well, that's... That was my only thought about how to get off this place. Does this guy know anything else? Listen, help me out of here, will you? Hey, can you no, hear me? No, 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 no. There must be something else that I need to do here. Oh, hang on. What if I change where the purple thing is going to? Because that, when it was on the red, maybe that was just linked up to 
No signal. Hang on, what? I thought we had already linked it up. It... Link established, 049. Okay, look, this is just trial and error at this stage. No idea. Zero four nine. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. Can we request the transport then? <gasps> no. It's on its way. Gotta get ready. Seriously, it's actually gonna get gonna get here. Where? And how long does this take? Does it land in the middle there, or...? Oh, there it is! That's definitely the Zeppelin. That's so cool! Look at that! I am hoping that Terry Akis is not on that. <laughs> wow! That's so, so cool! Just so crazy. That puzzle was actually kind of difficult. It took me a little while, but I really loved exploring Delta. That was so interesting. There's some so many unexplained things going on here. Hi. Calm down. We're safe. Oh, it's really disconcerting popping in and out of existence like that. Mm. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. Uh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. Got to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. Oh. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? <laughs> the toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Oh my gosh. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. Who <laughs> gives a chip? Oh, no. Oh, no. You know what that means? We're going to have to go and... Oh no, 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 no! It's not going to make us hurt that our little guy, our little helper robot, is it? I, I feel awful. The robots only appear intelligent. They're much more like dogs than humans. I wouldn't hit a dog. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> poor choice of words. I don't want to hurt anything. Well, we need a tool chip, or we're stuck here. Take the stun baton from the box I opened and hunt down a robot with a working tool chip. Take the stun baton from the box right over there and then go look for a robot with a working tool chip. Okay. But this is cool is that, that we no have like a weapon. I'm not going after our little guy. I'm not doing it. Nope. I'm not doing it. I'm not going to hurt our little guy. I was going to have to be this guy. I'm so sorry. 
Tell you the truth, I fucking love my job. I love that Delta is such a tight operation. Aww. I get to try everything here. I'm sorry. Oh, come on. <laughs> come back. Come back. I'm sorry. I feel so bad. Oh no. Oh gosh. I feel like a monster. That's terrible. Oh man. Oh, I'm sorry. Where's our little friend? He's probably gone. He's probably. S I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He's really unhappy <laughs> with us now, aren't you? He doesn't want to know us anymore. He regrets helping us. All right. Let's do it. Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We we'd be stuck here. I know. Did you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah. Well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> She's like, yeah, let's just go. Oh, bye little guy. I I don't know if you could actually attack the little guy, but there's no way ever I would like to do that. He's like the companion cube in Portal. You know, you you can't hurt that little guy. I don't think that Simon is a robot. This is still a simulation in my mind. You know what I mean? It's a simulation. Okay, what, 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 what now? The button? Okay. Thanks. Well, off we go. And this is kind of cool. First time in a Zeppelin. It's a very modern hot air balloon. Strange. So strange. It's just pitch black everywhere. Oh man, I don't know about this, hey? It's pitch black. It's dark. Destination Theta. Distance. Um. 228. You did really good back there, Simon. We got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Theta. Wow. Then we just head inside, grab the Dunvac, and head down the abyss. 4,000 meters. That's a long way. We don't have to worry, though, because with the Dunvac, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. That's great. And then... We can start listening to other people when they talk because that's how <laughs> conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <laughs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, is 
superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omnitool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Of course. Cap, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside Theta, okay? See you soon. Bye. Okay, so here we are. Okay guys, I'm going to end this video here. I have many, many questions and I don't know when they're going to get answered or if even if they will. I feel that I'm still stuck in the, this is a simulation from Dr. Munshi way of thinking. But you know what? I don't... I don't think that Simon thinks that anymore. When he woke up in the chair, he called out to Dr. Monshi, right? But now he seems to have forgotten that that even existed, that what happened there with him. He seems to actually truly believe that he is in this universe as a robot. Now that's not where my thinking is, but if that's what Simon is thinking, perhaps I need to start embracing that um, just so I can be more in tune with what Simon's thoughts and feelings are. I still obviously think that it's a simulation from Dr. Munchie, but what if something did actually, no, that can't be possible. It can't be possible if something just went wrong. Hang on. Oh my god, what if something did actually happen? What if he did get plugged into that machine? Something happened with the world. We had that comet, the meteor crash into Earth. It killed everybody. But because he was plugged into the machine, he survived. Is this crazy? Yes, it is. I'm now I'm starting to think along the lines of what's happening with Simon. I don't know what to think, but it's so interesting discovering all this. But we are at Theta now, and we know that Mr. Terry Akers is here, or he, he came here. I don't know how long ago, but I'm really curious to see if we get to see any more about what happened to him in this section. So I'm going to go and record the next bit now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Um, please try not to laugh at my stupid theories because I'm just dumb. But I will see you again really soon in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.